slick, smooth, and delicious. Creamy cocktail concoctions have been around at least since colonial times. Settlers brought drinks called flips over from the old country. They were made with beer or rum, sugar, eggs, and milk. And believe it or not, they were heated with a red-hot poker. At the turn of the last century, America rang in the golden age of the cocktail. The bartenders were master mixologists who catered to a choosy clientele. And they took their cocktails to the edge with groundbreaking ingredients. They created two classes of creative creamy cocktails. One that uses dairy, like cream or milk, for a thick, luscious treat. And another that uses frothy egg whites and thick syrupy liqueurs for a velvety smooth experience. After Prohibition, these creamy classic cocktails seem to fall out of fashion, but they're about to make a big comeback. If you put a grasshopper with heavy cream in front of some people, they, you know, ugh, you know, and the egg white, and we're, we're trying to, to turn people back onto that and um, let them know that egg white is not a bad thing in a drink. Gives it a really nice creamy sort of texture. Um, and I always ask people, if they, if they eat Eggs Benedict, then they're eating egg whites, you know, <laughs> so. Here are a couple of delicate, delectable drinks that are easy to master and impressive to serve. Whip up an exotic Pisco Sour by filling a shaker half full of ice and adding two ounces of Peruvian Pisco Brandy, one ounce of fresh lemon or lime juice, one ounce of simple syrup, and the white of one egg. Shake for at least 30 seconds to froth the egg white and strain into a champagne food. Garnish by adding three dots of Angostura bitters to the meringue on top. Or try the Brandy Alexander. In your shaker, mix one and a half ounces of brandy, one ounce dark creme de coco, and one ounce of half and half. Strain into a chilled cocktail glass and garnish with grated nutmeg. For the boxcar, mix one and a half ounces gin, one ounce triple sec, one teaspoon lemon juice, half teaspoon grenadine, and one egg white. Shake for at least 30 seconds and strain into a sour glass. The thought of using cream and raw egg whites is heavy, but here are a few tips to help smooth out your moves. Instead of prying into that eggshell and trying to separate the white from the yolk, pick up pasteurized egg whites from your local grocery store. Not only is it easier to use, but you'll give salmonella the slip. When it comes to cream, get creative. And here at Teeny Biggs, even our heavy cream has alcohol in it. We make our heavy cream with granulated sugar, a little light cream to cocoa, and just a touch of Kahlua as well. Or for your calorie conscious friends, substitute low fat or non-fat milk in their drinks. No matter how you mix it, creamy is dreamy. <laughs>